Here we go, yo. This is KMD Consultant back at you guys with a V. Nah, 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 nah. This, this is with a HD Zoom tutorial, a 16 gig joint, baby. You guys remember this stuff that Microsoft released? It was the hottest thing that they dropped, man. It was really great with HD radio, hit um, Apple product right out the box. But, you know, Apple fans are going to stick with their Apple product. Windows fans are going to stick with their Apple product. Wireless stuff, media player, music player, HD radio, video, multi-touch, web browsing, games. Wasn't really great for none of those things because <laughs> it didn't work. Like, I couldn't browse the web on that crap. The multi-touch was awesome. Video sucked. HD radio was cool. Music was awesome. Wireless sucked. Yeah, but it is what it is. Now, finding out the trash, I'm going to sell this bad boy. So, you know, I'm going to fire up uh, Windows um, I have Windows 7 here. I got to zoom and want to reset this thing. So they said that if you hold down, if you hold down the main button and the media button, it'll pop up saying, um, connect to your Windows PC. However, I've connected this to Windows PC and I'm still not getting Windows to detect this device I don't know why when I first started I run it in a Mac and then it I realized it doesn't have Mac software for this Zoom product to work so I fired up VMware load up Windows 7 download um, Zoom software and connected the device again but as you can see the device is not being connected um, totally you know totally you know messed me up that's what it is. So if anyone, so if anyone have the answer to restoring this device in a virtual environment on a Mac machine running VMware Fusion, Windows 7, 64-bit, let me know. Um, you can reply back to my post. Please subscribe and thank you for watching this tutorial. Have a great day, guys. Have a great day.